Hi everyone, welcome to your week six complete body workout. So for today, all you've been eating is your water, some weights, your dumbbells of three kilos or two kilos, depending on your level, some ankle weights or your elastic band, depending on what you have. We're gonna start with our first exercise, which are our burpees. So if you haven't done our warm up yet, try clicking in the box somewhere over here and then just do the warm up and then come back to this workout. So we're gonna start with our burpees. Make sure that your mat is clear in order not to kick anything away. And then we're gonna start with our burpees. You're gonna kick back, high plank and clap. Five more. Last one. And clap. Woo. How is this for a first exercise? So grab your waist for our walking lunges. If you have room, you can walk. If not, you can just stay on your mat. I'm taking my three kilo weights. You can choose four kilos as well, depending on your level. For each side, three, last one each side, great job, all right, place those weights away, so if you have an elastic band, place that one above your knees, if not, you can use your ankle weights for the donkey kicks. And then you're gonna place yourself, hands are under your shoulders, knees are under your hips, and then we're gonna kick our heel up towards the sky. Stay up, small pulses. Whew. These ones are hurting, but it's for the good cause, for your booty. 10 more, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and whew. place both knees on the floor. We're gonna go right into our next leg. Make sure your elastic is still there, and then go up and go back. Kick your heel up. When having any wrist issues, place yourself on your elbows. That's fine too. Five more, four, three, 
three, two, you're gonna stay up. I know you got this. Whew. Feel that peach burning. Kick your heel up. Make sure your leg is bended. Seven more. Six, five, four, three, two, and place yourself into child's pose. Stretch those glutes out. All right, take off your elastic or your ankle weights. By the way, can you leave in the comments below what kind of material you're using? If it's the elastic or the ankle weights, I'm just curious. All right, side plank. Place yourselves, make sure your mat is clear. Elbows are under your shoulder. Place yourself in the plank of variation of your choice. You can, or place your foot behind, be, in front of your knee. Up, and we're gonna go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, whoa, collapse. All right, other side. Are you feeling it inside abs? Good job. If this is too hard for you, don't be afraid to take variation of placing your foot in front of your knee. Shoulder under your, your elbow under your shoulder. Place yourself up. And then we're gonna go right back into those twist things. Grab your water, because round one is done. Today, my water is filled with ginger. Perfect combination. Okay, if you're ready for round number two, then let's get started. So if you're ready for jump sumo squats, we're gonna place ourselves in a sumo position. You're gonna place your toes outwards. You're gonna squat down, and you're gonna imagine the beach or your own living room is a trampoline. Squat and jump up. Make sure you're landing softly. legs off and you're gonna grab your three kilo weights depending on how your shoulders are feeling today so we're gonna squat down and we're gonna do a press squat down just normal squat squeeze your glutes and press
got this, come on. Feel like a power, lady or man. Last one. And place those weights away. Good job. Stretch your legs a little. Take your two times two kilo weight. This is for your abs. Russian V twist. I have my two times two kilos. You can choose just one dumbbell of three or grab a big bottle of water for one and a half. Place yourself on your bum. You have the option to place your feet on the floor or lift them up. Try to give yourself a challenge and start with lifting your legs up. And if you can't anymore, then place them down, that's fine. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Leave those dumbbells. Our last exercise with the second round, and then we guys are already halfway. Go into your high planks for a Spider-Man push-up. So remember we did that last time. You're gonna push just a little bit through. Don't go all the way down if you want. You can, of course, but try. Keep it safe as possible. Kind of place yourselves on your toes. Spider-Man push-up. chest, relax our shoulders, grab your drink, because you guys are halfway. I hope you guys are ready for round, round number three. We're gonna start with our burpees. If you're ready, clap for yourself, kick back, kick in, and clap again. for these workouts. Walking lunges or in place lunges, depending if you have any room, you're gonna take a big leap forward, come back and do the same thing to the other side.
in total. Four, chest is up. Three, two, last one. Throw away those weights. Elastic or your ankle weights. I know ankle weights take a little bit more time to put on, so just press pause. Place them on at your own pace. Above your knees for your donkey kicks. Booty. Hands are under your shoulders. Your knees under your hips. Kick your heel up and go down. Sweat dripping, that's perfectly fine. Minus two, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and tabletop position. Shake your booty like a dog waggle its tail. <laughs> Other side. pulses. If you cry, cry. I'm crying on the inside because it's hurting so much. <sighs> 10 seconds more. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and child's pose. <sighs> Stretch that booty. Take away the elastic. <sighs> We're gonna go after our legs into our abs. You can take away your sweat like so. If you have a towel, even better. Side planks. Place yourself on the elbow. Remember the one we did in the first round? You gotta choose if you want to put your foot in front of your knee or if you want to put place them together. I'll be now doing the alter alternative one like so and twist. Looking up. Five, four, three, two, and rest. Get ready for the next side. And then after that, you can get a sip of water.
five, four, three, two, and collapse. We're gonna place ourselves in our sumo position. Toes are facing outwards. Your knees are gonna go towards your toes and then jump all the way up. If you're ready, start the timer somewhere. That was the last jumping exercise of today. Grab your weights to continue. Shake the sand away. To continue with our squat and press. Place yourself in a normal squat. Grab your waist in front of you. Squat down, all the way down your heels. Squeeze your glutes and press up. Raise those dumbbells. Shake your shoulders. Roll them. Grab your weights for your Russian feet twist. The one we're switching side by side. I got four kilos in total, but you can grab six if you want to. Or two, that's fine. Just grab a weight, grab a puppy, grab a child, place them. Choose your level and then side by side. Make sure that your back is almost dropping on the floor but you have to engage your abs to stand still. Eight more, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Weights away, no more weights for today. We have one more exercise to go, and then we're gonna get right in back to our plank challenge. So, before doing the plank challenge, we have our Spider-Man push-ups. Hands on your shoulders, place yourself in a high plank, and you're gonna bend your elbows just a tiny bit. Make sure your mat is clear. Last exercise, you guys and then plank.
four more. Three, two, one. Open your shoulders, open your chest, relax your shoulders. I don't know if you guys can see my sweat dripping, but it's hot here. And we're working, it's a perfect combination. All right, if you guys are ready, put yourself in elbow plank. We're gonna try to do one minute 30. If you can do a little bit more, that's fine. If you're collapsing at one minute 20, perfect as well. Place yourself in the elbow plank. We're gonna start the timer. Three, two, and plank. Guys, I'm shaking, you're shaking. Whew. 10 more. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and you can collapse. All right, grab your water, take a sip, a well-deserved sip. Make sure that you're checking with me so I can see how your progress is going with hashtag feelfantastic or hashtag feelft. Make sure that you're doing your stretch routine after this one. This complete body stretch routine is perfect for after this workout and I'll see you next workout. Bye bye.